Good morning. It is back. No, it's full body day. I tried to film a workout yesterday and it didn't work. We're gonna do it today. We're doing deadlifts. No crazy quirky kind of fun. I wanna do more mic type workouts so I can actually talk to you like it's like a one to one. No personal training slash. Um, I'm in a great mood this morning. I'm feeling very purple. I'm tanned. I'm like a little boy, buddy. Yeah, I tried to film this yesterday and my mic was messed up. So it turns out I need to talk to you like here if I want you to actually hear me. So we're gonna we're gonna try and get this done today, ladies. So we're going through a full upper body type of workout. I have not got this planned at all. I just know I want to do some deadlifts. So we're gonna do some deadlifts. So can you hear me? If I put you like this, if I put you like this, can you hear me? I think you can. I need to get a wireless mic. This is a reminder: get a wireless mic, babes. But so I've done the dynamic warm up. It wasn't that fun, so I didn't film it. But I just did a lot of crazy stuff. I'm actually going to do a little bit more because I'm not feeling really, really loose. So we're going to warm up together, I guess. I'm going to have to bring my cord with me. I like to do low squats. Archer, could you talk to you? I like to do low squats, opening up my hips because I've got the tightest hips apparently. I'm gonna move this the man next to me. And I think he thinks I'm gonna be a bit weird. But also, he cares. So I like to just sit swinging it. I feel this in at my hips. I can feel my knee clicking. I did some dead hangs and I felt the most like Intense compress, decompress of my back, uncompress, hello, decompress of my back. I'm gonna do another one actually. Your tears fall in the first Can you come with? It's risky. I'm only four or five, but it's too tall for me. It's intense. So yeah, we're gonna do deadlifts. I've only ever tried deadlifts once, you know, so I don't actually know what to expect. My one rep mat, I don't know, ooh, really. I don't even know what my one rep, one rep is. I'm just gonna get the flow bit, just get one in. You're one kid. Oh, hello, guys. Someone's having a man. I'm having a man today. I don't think he was involved in it. I hope everyone's doing well today. I just had a one-to-one -one with my new client, which is adorable, and I love it. I'm going to do some practice, just RDO top things. I'm going to bring you in. Personal trainer swing it to this. I also trained the boots yesterday. And um, my hamstrings hurt. So I want to do I need to do tens either side. Our gym got new tens. And they're really cute, so I'm gonna use these tens. Hey, I need clips. I hate clips. So, I'm gonna do some practice once. You're gonna have feet like normal stance, like hip width, I guess, and you're going to sit down into it. You wanna bring it close, and you're gonna lodge down and then pull up and then keep it really close to you to I haven't started my watch there my nose hurts today and what we're going to sit down into it that felt good two I might ask Matt to come and look at my dead look Five. Oh, that's a lot, you know. I'm gonna do 60. There was. I'm gonna see if one of my Pure Gym peeps can help me look at my form real quick because 
Like I said, pure gyms, pure gyms. Personal trainers don't always know what they're doing. And I've only ever done deadlifts once and I was with my pure gym base. Um, so he was like telling me everything. Um, so I just want to check that I'm doing form right. Feels absolutely fine, just I want to check. Do you get what I mean? No one is here, so I'm on my own. We're just going to wing it. We're going to hope for the best. Let's try 60, shall we? I don't think I'm going to go more than 60. I'm also going to listen to my music because I really I get out of my head if I'm not listening to my music and it really stresses me out. Lady, lady. That was rather easy, babes. So that was rather easy. We're gonna do 18 or 70. 80. We're gonna do 80 for eight, and then maybe 90 for six. I need my grip straps so. though. There it's for show. I've got all three green plates. There we go. Let's just put these on. I get my grip straps out. I get my grip straps. Grip straps. I've got one really old my protein and one beast rage one because keep it pure gym, love you, but can you leave the same grip straps? Because these are from Lost and Found. Um, so, can you leave the same ones, please? Anyway, we're gonna go for 80 for eight, or six or eight. I might actually change where you are though, but I'm not gonna do my mic for this one. So I'll catch up with you in a sec. trying again we're doing 60 though because 90 was barely moving the gym just got really busy which makes me really sad it went turning so because my mic wasn't mic no what no what because <laughs> my mic wasn't wireless and the gym got really busy like as you can see around me there are plenty of people so i decided not to mic up this bit i did some of that pull downs i did four sets of eight i started with lighter weight and really focused on feeling in my lats because back days for me they're a bit meh sometimes i just struggle to feel it in my back and i've got quite a defined back i think personally i just really struggle with lat pull downs i kept the load pretty light on this but I just made sure to really drive my elbows into the floor, squeeze my lats. And for form, yeah, you wanna keep your core really tight. You want to lean back a little bit when you're coming down. You don't want a complete straight torso, but you wanna make sure you're not kind of lying down and just pull the bar towards you, driving those elbows into the floor. I really like this movement. I just struggle sometimes. That's why I did like a really slow descent. Is that what it's called? I think, yeah, just to really fill my lats. Anyway, then my mic broke. So you know how I said earlier, you know, reminder, get a wireless mic. Well, I had to because my mic just like stopped working. I think I, I don't know what I did actually. I mean, I'm a bit rough with it, but I think I just, you know, it had enough for me. Bye bye, RIP. So I've bought a wireless one. I did some dumbbell shoulder press. I had to sit in the like really heavy dumbbell bit there's a bit in my gym which has mirrors that you can look at and i had to do it in the non-mirror part so i felt a bit weird and i don't know how good my form was but i did four sets hello does it work now someone just failed their bench rip eight to ten 
here's me trying to figure out whether my mic was working and it wasn't so I just kind of gave up but I did start with 14 kg and then I went down because sis was just feeling a bit fried in this workout so I think that's also why I didn't get my max on my deadlift because I was just feeling a bit tired overall this was my fourth or fifth session of the week so you know by the end of the week I'm a bit fried quick form advice for shoulder press you want your arms coming out to the side but not completely you want your elbows in slightly at an angle and you want the dumbbells in an angle as well and you're just going to push up you don't want to lock out any of your elbows any of your elbows your elbows you want to keep it very flowy then we moved on to dumbbell bench press i freaking love this movement i feel like dumbbell bench has been really helping my barbell bench like i've been pring my barbell bench quite a lot recently and I've been implementing dumbbell bench quite a lot recently as well. Definitely recommend if you want to work on your barbell bench or if you haven't really started doing much barbell bench, definitely do some dumbbell bench. I freaking love dumbbell bench. For form advice, you don't want your elbows coming really out to the sides. You want them at an angle in slightly. Same with your hands at an angle. It's just like shoulder press. You're just lying down and you're pushing out in front of you rather than above you. Keep your arms nice and loose keep everything at an angle you don't want anything locking out or anything also i love how my knees are just tapping i love to tap my feet a lot just to remind myself that they're there and lastly for this workout we did some rear delt flies so i rarely ever do this exercise but my days it was insane so i will be doing it a lot more for form advice you want to make sure that the little handles i'm pushing are in line with your shoulders so i think maybe this was a little bit too high but our adjustable seat was broken so i kind of just had to you know do what i could but you want to push back push the handles back it is just an insane exercise like freaking love